Eve and Adam by Edwina Sands. That's me. The book of life starts with a man and a woman in a garden and it ends with revelations. Oscar Wilde. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth and the earth was without form and void and darkness was upon the face of the deep. And God formed woman of the dust of the ground and breathed into her nostrils the breath of life and woman became a living soul. And the hip which the Lord God had taken from woman made he a man because he was taken out of woman. And they were both naked, the woman and her husband, and were not ashamed. And God commanded them saying, of every tree of the garden thou mayest freely eat but of the tree of knowledge of good and evil, thou shalt not eat of it, or thou shalt surely die. Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die, for God doth know that in the day ye eat thereof, then shall your eyes be opened, and ye shall be as gods. And when the woman saw that the tree was good for food, and that it was pleasant to the eyes, and a tree to be desired to make one wise, she took of the fruit thereof, and did eat. And her eyes were opened, and she gave also unto her husband, and he did eat. And Eve knew Adam, her husband. They knew that they were naked, and they sewed fig leaves together, and made themselves aprons. And they heard the voice of God, and Eve and her husband hid themselves. And God said unto the woman, What is this that thou hast done? I will greatly multiply thy sorrow and thy conception, and thy desire shall be to thy husband, and he shall rule over thee. And the Lord God said, Behold, the woman is become as one of us, knowing good and evil. And now, lest she puts forth her hand and takes also of the tree of life and eats and lives forever, Therefore must I send them forth from the Garden of Eden. Following God's instructions, they go forth and multiply. They beget and begat until the world has begotten billions. One child per family, Chairman Mao's Little Red Book. God made the country and man made the town, J. H. Payne. It's not a concrete jungle, it's a human zoo, Desmond Morris. Computers are useless, they can only give you answers, Pablo Picasso. Give me chastity and continence, but not just now, St. Augustine. You're not just sleeping with one person, you're sleeping with everyone they ever slept with, Teresa Crenshaw. Life is a sexually transmitted disease, Guy Bellamy. I wouldn't put it past God to arrange a virgin birth, but I very much doubt if he would, Bishop of Durham. I've noticed that everyone that is for abortion has already been born, Ronald Reagan. If men could get pregnant, abortion would be a sacrament. Florence Kennedy. Home life is no more natural to us than a cage is natural to a cockatoo. George Bernard Shaw. You can never be too rich or too thin. Babe Paley. Stay young and beautiful. It's your duty to be beautiful. BBC Woman's Hour. There's only one thing worse than being talked about, and that is not being talked about. Oscar Wilde. Psychiatry enables us to correct our faults by confessing our parents' shortcomings. Lawrence J. Peter. Sometimes a cigar is just a cigar. Sigmund Freud. Let's find out what everyone is doing and then stop everyone from doing it. A.P. Herbert. 
folks who have no vices have very few virtues. Abraham Lincoln. Touch not, taste not, handle not. St. Paul. When women say no, she means yes. Calypso song. Money was exactly like sex. You thought of nothing else if you didn't have it, and thought of other things if you did. James Baldwin. Money is better than poverty, if only for financial reasons. Woody Allen. The new job of art is to sit on the wall and get more expensive. Robert Hughes. Anyone who paints the sky green and pastures blue ought to be sterilized. Adolf Hitler. It's hard for me to get used to these changing times. I can remember when the air was clean and sex was dirty. George Burns. We'll all go together when we go. Tom Lehrer. Canst thou by searching find God? Book of Job. Listen, there's a hell of a good universe next door. Let's go, E.E. E. Cummings. God has put up with the adventures of Eve and Adam from the beginning of time to the brink of the black hole. Will he ever put his foot down? I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the ending. The sun became black as sackcloth of hair, and the moon became as blood. And the stars of heaven fell unto earth, for the great day of his wrath is come and who shall be able to stand? Revelations. For behold, I create new heavens and a new earth, and the former shall not be remembered, nor come into mind. Isaiah. What's past is prologue. Shakespeare. Que sera, sera, 